we're on a mission to try and help people use uh, files within the cloud um, to help adopt these new ways of working, these new habits. And we have a new tool available to us when we're working with OneDrive. Now, in a previous video, we took a look at how to synchronize our desktop and our documents folders from our computer. And that means that, great, they're backed up. Uh, but one of the things that we have been able to do is add a shortcut to some of the common locations that we work in across the cloud. Uh, now, while we are in OneDrive and in our, our web browser, we see different shared libraries that we can work in. And I belong to the Mark 8 project team. Now, I could go into OneDrive and, and have a look at my shared files and shared, shared libraries from here. And the handy thing here is that I can see exactly where I am. And as I go down into the go to market plan where I'm quite active and trying to contribute, uh, then I can see the files that I am working on. If I wanted to make this a bit easier to find, especially from my desktop, then I've got a new button available to me called Add Shortcut to My Files. I'm in the folder now, so when I click Add Shortcut to My Files, then that's going to add that folder, <laughs> that shortcut to the My Files experience within OneDrive. Let's have a look. So we're in My Files, and now we have a new shortcut available within OneDrive. It doesn't seem that glamorous, right? It doesn't seem like it does much. Uh, in fact, if we click on through here, it's gonna take us through to the same files that if we might visit Mark 8, go to Market Plan, and here's the same files. So what's the difference? Well, this is where we're again helping our people to adopt working in the cloud by meeting them in a familiar experience. Where else do we see this My Files shortcut? We see it on the desktop. Uh, let's uh, just make these icons a bit bigger so we can see them. There we go, there is our go-to-market plan. It's a shortcut within Windows Explorer, Files Explorer, sorry. And it feels like I can go and go straight into those files that I'm working on. And I can double click on that file and down it comes using files on demand with OneDrive and I can start working on it on my desktop. It's a bit like saying, right, I'm gonna be working on a lot of content around the go-to market plan, so I'm planning to bring that into my, my files or my OneDrive and make it easy for me to work on it from Files Explorer. So that's quite handy. Now just to show you the effect of the shortcut is not just a shortcut and directing us to somewhere, but if I wanted to grab, let's say, a document from, well, let's grab a picture. So here's a picture from my desktop, and I'm going to go into the Go To Market Plan folder. We'll paste that in there. We can see that it's synchronizing. So OneDrive is sending it somewhere. Where is it sending it? Let's go back over to OneDrive in the Mark 8 project team, the go-to market plan. There's that file. Nice connection, isn't it? Being able to connect to the common places that we're working within a team, within a SharePoint site, uh, but using this shortcut that we can put in My Files. We can see it in My Files in OneDrive on our browser, and we can see it in My Files over there in Files Explorer. So that's a, another good thing that we can use to help people adopt and use uh, and work with files within Microsoft 365 across Microsoft Teams, SharePoint, and various other places where we store files. If you'd like more of these tips around how to work with uh, the cloud within the modern workplace, then you know what to do and you know where to find me. Uh, we'll see you again soon. Bye for now.